All right, that was weird. The video cut out explaining these covers and all. But yeah, I think I'm gonna go back to this style just because um, yeah, I want people to be able to use the uh, China cranks because it's hard to keep the other cranks in stock. It, it really, what it comes down to, it cost me 20, 30,000 just to get a, a batch run and it's a lot of money. And the volume of pre-sales are not coming in in time to, you know, but by the time I get enough money to actually execute, the people who put in the money first are waiting just way too long. And they can't be having that. Also, I gotta find a way to move these hubs. Uh, so far, really good reviews on them. But I think the way I'm selling them is funny. I'm gonna try to package them together as like a front hub assembly, rear hub assembly. Instead of selling it all individual so you can customize it and all. And so use this solid axle, really big bearings. These are the, uh, how you bolt it to the dropout, 10 millimeter. There are Minarelli left. You got a contact pad funked for these AIM 6s. He purchased everything left. Um, video of the bike coming soon. I just got to up the jet. But yeah, definitely some videos coming. The hubs, okay, yeah. And then, real quickly about these cases. The latest design, we talked about the ignition. I just really put as much material everywhere as possible. Really obnoxious. Minerali Max and AM6 Max. It's it's all super obnoxious this time. But it's also just big blocks of aluminum. Just and that's been the yeah, Puck's performance. Really appreciate him helping out this latest round and uh into the future. Lots of heads. We've got to talk about the heads real quick and I think then we can go. standard Piaggio heads. I know a couple of these I did. Uh, well, we have them for the, yeah, I think these might be them. These are for Stroker. Stroker, what is that, Minarelli? It's the Athena Minarelli Racing. That one with the really funny way it bolts on and all. And the, it has a flat piston and special bolts and all that, but yeah, we got those heads in stock. We got one for Stroker, and then I, I think one for standard Stroke. You want to use like a stock crankshaft. So yeah, those are in stock. I know a few people wanted those. Um, and then we did like an extra, extra Stroker Piaggio for people who want to try to somehow fit a even more Stroke into their Piaggio. But most of these are just normal Piaggio heads. Uh, that's that. Oh, also, I am going to try to uh, start shipping regularly again. I think the key is start having everything pre-packed. I don't currently have everything pre-packed, but I'm getting there. And, uh, yeah, I don't know. I'm getting interested in the hobby again. I think, uh, I think it's time to really get a little more serious with this hobby and see where it goes. I also have some electric... I'm going to basically make an electric motor uh, that bolts in the same way as these motors. Either with this style mount or with a flat mount. I'm not really sure yet, but uh, yeah, I mean, I, if we have a bike that's all already fully built, I think we, it would be good to have a motor that can go up to about like eight horsepower. That's lightweight and that fits exactly where the motor does and still has room for a battery above it. So you can take your, you know, if you, if you have a bike that you're actually commuting with and you get pulled over and they're giving you trouble, they don't like that it's gas powered, you can for an afford, affordable price convert your bike to electric. Or just if you, you like building different builds, you can have one electric in the fleet to to test out, you know, and it's it'll be a hot rod. It'll be powerful. And yeah, that's that. But the main thing is it'll be designed that it'll uh, have a chain drive on this side use standard 41 chain, not 35 like that. Yeah, I can't wait for the video of this. This bike's been great. 
it does need a little more heating capacity, but my short little burst, it's been fine. All right, guys, I gotta go take a, a trip. Thanks for everyone for your patience. Oh, we, we will be uh, doing our auction for one of these Minarelli. I just been behind. It's yeah, we don't need to get into all that that's been going on here, but we've also been shipping like crazy and we are pretty much caught up. So later guys, thanks everyone.